that right there is a lot of things that just appeared. Let's go through them. The gallery has been updated with... Oh, I guess I never checked those. Okay, well. Okay, each step like thunder, huh? For Ateno. So I assume we're going to be using Vanaboris there, most likely. Since we used Varudania after we saved Mifa and Daruk. We used Vameto after we saved Rivali and Urbosa. We used freaking Varuta just now before the Akala Tower. And now I assume we're going to be using Vanaboris. Most likely. So what have we here anyway? Hylian Blacksmith Guild discount. Ooh. I mean, yeah, I need those Bokoblin trophies. And yes, indeed, Super Hyper. There are a lot of different characters available in this game. I'm currently at 13. And I'm fairly certain there's still some more to unlock. I mean, I'm playing mostly Link, so I mean, I'm not showcasing a whole lot myself, but uh, his Link is kind of the one that feels most natural to me right now. Yeah, everything needs a lot of Bokoblin trophies. Hmm. I wouldn't mind the... Okay, this one... Wait, this one doesn't take Bacoblin Trophy, so maybe we'll do this one. Children aren't normally allowed at the flight range, but at Teba's suggestion, young Rita will go on a field trip to, there to enjoy... To learn the joy of training at Cat Words. Prepare packed lunches for the kids to eat. Here we go, so that doesn't need Bacoblin Trophies, luckily. Looking pretty good, huh? The children were so enraptured seeing the warriors train up close. They hardly touched their packed lunches. Field trip inspired them to think about how to keep Hyrule safe. Nice. I want more combos, though. There's a bonus combo for Rivali, and he's a bunch of Bokoblin trophies. Teba bonus heart. Teba bonus combo. And Teba's kind of like my kind of spicy go-to Rito right now. The strongest string. A renowned... That, that's my freaking Link string. The harmonic loop thing. thing where Bob. A renowned boyer in Rito Village has a technique for making bow strings more resilient. But it calls for armor ranth. To gain an edge in the battles ahead, seek out the rare plant. Will do. Here you go. Yeah, bonus combos are going to be my priority over bonus hearts. Training for hours with his newly reinforced bow, Teba thought... Te it's, I know it's not Teba, as I always said it. It's like Teba? Teba thought up a new move. Now he's itching for the chance to use it against monsters. So I'll expand that string a little bit. Sheikah Slate bonus combo. Oh, nice, and it doesn't need any Bacoblin trophies. The researchers have an ambitious idea for the next experiment, but they're sorely lacking the funds they need to make it happen. Help them scrape together some cash. And a few other things. So let's go ahead and do that. When you, when you announced the good news, the lab erupted with cheers. Now we can pull off the experiment for sure. You felt certain the researchers will put your donation to good use. Yeah, I find that interesting how Zelda's Sheikah Slate weapon doesn't continue making more and more combos like the other ones. It just expands your existing ones with more expresses. This is the thing. So like... That's a bonus heart for Sidon and these Bokoblin trophies and stuff. Gain ability to increase max weapon level. I haven't even gotten up to level 20 for weapons yet. But I mean, it doesn't take the Coblin trophy, so I mean, a weapon maker in Zora's domain got roped into construction on a stone monument and has no time to work on weapons. Go find the materials to finish the monument. Okay, easy peasy. Yeah, let's do that. The monument was finished ahead of schedule. The Zora were grateful for your help. The weapon maker was glad of it too and showed you a Zora smithing technique. Smithing's best of the best of gather. You can now raise the maximum level of your weapons at the Highland Blacksmith Guild. I haven't even gotten something to level 20 yet, so yeah, I don't even have enough Bokoblin trophies there anymore. Um, let's see here. Sidon bonus combo, so I'll probably do- th that's a lot of rupees that I need. Some folks are planning to open a waterfall climbing workshop at Zora's Domain. Open to students of all ages. Sidon is asking for donations to help bring the idea to fruition. Here you go, I'm basically broke now. <laughs> With donations rolling in, the workshop announced it would be opening soon. Meanwhile, Sidon trained tirelessly at Veiled Falls so that he would be ready to impart his techniques to others. Cool. I guess we'll do this apparently, which is bonus hearts. Uh, Zora and Lightning do not mix. Some have tried to address the issue using Electro Elixirs, but they have little effect on Zora. Maybe a certain fruit would prove more effective. Okay, here's some Volt Fruit. There you go. There you have it. I shall handle the next tussle. I shall handle the next tussle. The Zora served up the meal at a big lightning-proof luncheon, and it was so delicious that all attendees cleaned their plates in a flash. Only time will tell if it helps, but at least it was tasty. Cool. Oh, we got our second hyped person here. I wasn't even paying attention. Got a whole bunch of stuff from the sea. Cool. We got a dish here. Oh, and it's just a fairy. A chef known for innovation wants to create something new. But what? He's not sure. As a first step... Uh, he wants to research something. If you bring it to him, he'll share what he learns. A recipe for fairy tonic. So that would be a use for fairies, then. 
The chef failed to create a new dish to add to his repertoire, but he did learn how to harness the power of what you brought him to make a strange new elixir. You now know the recipe. Fairy tonic. Auto revive once after KO for the cost of one fairy. This powerful recovery elixir harnesses the power of fairies as a sweet fragrance. Huh. I could have used that earlier. Can I buy this from somewhere? It looks like I probably can. Yeah. Unless, yeah. Oh. I typically need these for things, oh. so I'm gonna like buy them as well. Um, I typically oh. need those for some things too, oh. so I'll buy them too. All right, really new recipe. Let's see here. A budding cook is eager to try a new recipe and said that if you bring her the ingredients, she'll make it for you or uh, try to. <laughs> All right, the really new recipe. Let's go ahead and research that. Though new to cooking, she made a meat pie that looked scrumptious, but it seemed that by make it for you, she just meant get away, it's mine. Well, you have the recipe at least. Meat pie, meal effects, damage plus 10%. Ooh. Only an extra napkin to deal with this juicy pie of perfectly baked minced meat. Ooh. Yeah. Hmm. I'm gonna mm. get things like this because they mm. help me continue oh. getting experience up recipes and such. What have we here? Two handed weapon bonus combo. Nice. Refuel motivation. The volunteer army has invited brave souls from across Hyrule to train together and prepare for the calamity. Get some provisions for the big day. Well, do. We need some Hinox trophies for that one. Mm. Where their stomachs full of tasty food, the fighters really threw themselves into the joint training session. All the participants improved their two handed weapon skill. Nice. So I guess we got all the combos for that now for Link. It seems like anything else lit up that I can ham out? Doesn't look like. Doesn't seem like it. So the things I'm currently tracking are bonus combo over here. I need crabs. Because that one doesn't need Bacoblin trophies. What else am I tracking at the moment? Uh, special attack H plus one because that also didn't need Bacoblin trophies. I mean, what have we over here anyway? Gain ability. Oh, here's the thing. Yeah, the one site was lying about like at what point I can get it. But this is what gives me the ability to remove seals on weapons to make them fully customizable. So yeah, definitely want that at some point. I need Lazalfos trophies for that one. Huh. Never thought the day would come that I'd be running out of trophies and stuff. Fire hazards, huh? Gives me Sheikah leggings. Hmm. Yeah, so I assume that we'd be using Divine Beast Vana Boris over here. There's so much orange on the map, but I think I kind of want to continue with the story for now, so it looks like Zelda's required. And then for my third one, we can go with, say, I want to get more combos on Sidon before using him more, even though I like really like his idea, his boundless enthusiasm and such. So we might stick with our basic three, is what I might do. And these battles are typically really long, the story ones, so more experience. I believe so. Is what we'll do. Each step like thunder. Let's see what we have here. Working together, they successfully recaptured the Citadel. Shortly thereafter, they found Robbie, who had barely escaped from the laboratory after the Yiga clan infiltrated its walls. The party soon learned from Robbie that Pura had also escaped the laboratory making her way to Fort Hateno in the Cluda. The stronghold, however, was besieged by enemies. Link and the others departed promptly for Fort Hateno, but who would quell the ceaseless onslaught of guardians pouring onto Hyrule Field during this time? so defeated together we'll put a stop to it but how look how many there are I would likely have died if it wasn't for your courage but I'm still here and Naboris still has its pilot I'd wager nothing can stop us we will triumph hmm. exactly well then, let's begin. Will you take my hand? Yes.
All right, so Naboris definitely feels like one of the more OP ones to me. So I feel like we should definitely be able to deal with things here. Yeah, but you don't. Stop. Stop that. And then we'll do this. Yeah, I feel like Naboris is definitely one of my, one of my better ones. Rudania is the one that's the hardest for me. Uh, I feel like then Ruta, Rudania, Ruta, then Meadow Naboris. Or maybe Meadow might even be easier than Naboris. I don't know. But you don't. Stop. Oh, I can only have that up for so long. Or I can only shield so many hits then. Okay, cool. Well, defeat every guardian. Hmm. Well, do. Where is every guardian, huh? Zippity zap. Are the, that's like Malice Swamp, I think. Ow, what are you throwing at me? The hell? I hear the Moblins so they don't throw junk at me. Oh, a huge Guardian Force has appeared. Okay, well, this away. That was not as many Guardians as were in the, you know, kind of preview thing, Bob. What's up? You wanna not? You wanna not do that? Coming through! Coming through, gotta get all those sails and stuff. Well, and then we do this. So, uh, goodbye. Yeah, Naboris is kind of crazy. Yeah, Naboris is frankly kind of crazy. I would say. Let's zippity zap. Can I do this again? Neat. Alright, there's a couple that I missed over here, apparently. According to my map. What? Oh, here you guys are. Here y'all are. Ooh, don't you dare do that. Okay, so they're dealt with, except for one apparent. Why do I still see an icon? Hey! Hey! No, oh, escaping unscathed. Okay. So there's another guardian force over. Oh, now it's just defeat many enemies. Except defeat every guardian. Well, consider it done. Consider it done in that case. 30,000 you want me to defeat, huh? Well, I mean, we racked them up pretty quickly. Oh, why can't I get over this? Get me over this! Are you kidding me right now? Do I have to go down the... Oh, I have to go down this way? Wacky. Hmm. Well. Cool. So yeah, let's keep on taking out these areas of enemies. This is what we do. There's a little bit of a squad right here. The map is very helpful. More guardian units have appeared and all around me too. Oh, yikes. Oh, yikes. Well... There's some ones behind me that I should probably deal with before anything here. Neat. So they're dealt with. There's one right here. Hey. Okay, neat. So then we turn around. Over to this way. Take out those dudes. And then we've got some guardians all the way over there. Or had some guardians way over there. Come on, get out of here. Okay, take them out. Crap. Oh, I can't put up my shield right now. Well, coming through, coming through. That was the one thing I could think of right there. Wah, and then panic, which seems to work with Naboris, luckily. Okay, what do you think you're doing over here? Cool, that the time limit remains. Okay, we're on a good track right now. Who's over there, what? Okay, there you go that. Make sure we take out this squad and stuff. Oh. Oh, sup, nerds? Coming through! Stop. Oh my goodness, the landscape is changing as we do that. It's getting stomped in. Um, hi there. Bye there. Goodbye! Zippity zap. You will not be spared, Mr. Ice Wiz Rogue, dude. Coming through! Coming through! Well. Yeah. Now seems like a pretty good time to do this, methinks. Yup. I think I figured right. Alright, coming through. Squeezy! Squeezy! Yeah, you were kind of in the wrong place at the wrong time. Oh my goodness! Yeah. What the heck is this crap? Well, that was a lot of guardians. Um, I stop. I mean, I guess I can just charge through. Coming through! Squeezy! 
I've got places to be. Stop. Stop that. Yeah, that is a lot of guardians. Let's just take them out. There we go. My goodness, spicy spice. Look at this land. Also, I could have just do the cam a little bit. What? A little bit down? Something like this. There we go. There we go. Oh yeah, motion controls and stuff. Okay, each step like thunder. Alrighty. Wacky. That was a lot of enemies. Bosa and Riju took control of Varnagoras, working to stem the never-ending flow of Guardians. Taking advantage of the opening Obosa had provided, Link's party began their assault on the enemies surrounding the periphery of Fort Hateno. <laughs> <laughs> 